All right, so what we're working on today is the Santee Thermo Valve 303. The complaint was auto inflating. So these guys are really easy to work on. And let's go ahead and just show you how we break it down and how you can go ahead and put some new O-rings in there. So you're gonna take, first remove the 303 valve from your dry suit just by unscrewing the back cap so that we have access to the valve. And then if you look inside the valve, uh, you've got a C-clip and obviously we got the button side. So what I'm gonna do here is I'm gonna remove that C-clip. I find just a very small uh, flat head and I'm just prying it right at where the C-clip's at. that. Now, if I just press this little button here, it comes out. So what you've got going on here is you've got two very fine O-rings. Um, you would just go ahead and remove these two O-rings, change them out, get them lubed up. Make sure you've got a nice motion. Nothing's feeling sticky, anything like that. You've got dirt and debris inside the barrel. You can clean out that with a Q-tip. This one feels good. I've already changed the O-rings and lubed them up. I'm then gonna put on the spring. The spring is gonna fit into the recess. There is no right or wrong way really here. And so the trickiest part of this whole quick service is getting the C-clip back to sit. So, trying my best so that you guys can still see what's going on here. I find using a little pair of needle nose, best way to start it. First time I did this, I fought it for about a good five minutes, so just patience is what you need here. starting to line up. Okay, so now you can kind of see I've got it just laying there. Now what I found was using that flathead again, pressing right on dead center, pushing down. And now it's back into place. Got nice motion. As always, what you're gonna do next, do your final check. Go ahead and plug it into an uh, inflator hose. Spray some soapy water in here. Listen, depress the button a few times. Make sure you got good motion and you're not getting any leakage. Then reattach it to your dry suit. That's just the quick and easy way how to service the Santee 303 valve and change out the O-rings.